Hello lovely people. I welcome you once again to Bright and Clarice channel. Thank you all for clicking. This is episode 8 on a three bedroom house that we are putting up for Lisa and London. All right. So in the view is a total breakdown which we we are almost done with the foundation. So in the video what you're going to be seeing is the foundation work. And so when we move on to the superstructure, I will let you know it is costing us $55,772. This comprises of a three bedroom, four bathrooms, okay, with a hall, kitchen, and a dining. Are you with me? It has a rooftop. As you can see right now, on the right hand side is a complete concrete slab. You have to climb the staircase and go to the rooftop. You understand? So, all these included is 55000 This is reasonable. You understand? It was designed by Jonathan Tete. Jonathan Tete, they have a big company. Okay, it is owned by Jonathan's big sister. So it's an architectural company, not just one man sitting somewhere. This is a big company. So if you need Jonathan to design your house for you, contact him now. If you need a permit for your building and whatsoever that you need, contact Jonathan Tete. All right, so I welcome you to Ebri Amam from. This is Great City, phase, phase two or phase three. I keep forgetting though, <laughs> but that is, that is okay. So, we are still on the fencing and in the meantime, we are back on the main house. Compacting is completed and plumber is at the side to do all the plumbing works. Here, it is very, very important. The positioning of your plumbings, it is very, very crucial because once we cast the oversized concrete, in case you want to do changes, you have to crack the concrete to be able to remove the pipes and those pipes cannot be used anymore you have to buy another pipe so at this particular moment whatever changes that you need to do has to be communicated properly to both the supervisor the mason and the plumber because why they need to make sure measurement there has there has to be precision the pipes need to be positioned in a way that will not impede the blood laying of the mason you understand yes it needs to be positioned with high sense of precision and also to suit the client preference the plumber must understand his craft and then also he need to marry the mason and you know, together so that they can do the plotting because they need to pull up the tape draw the measurement and know where the blocks is going to be this is where the pipe is going to be and so i want my wc here i want my wash basin here i want my jacuzzi here all these are necessary they are necessary you understand so if you want to be the neighbor of madame lisa in london like i said you can go to the youtube channel which says uh, the budley's journey to ghana okay the budley's journey to ghana has been shown on the screen the Budley's journey to Ghana. Okay, you can write to her via email in case you need a land in that particular area. She is an ambassador for this particular area. Whatever land that you need, write to her via the email and she will respond to you and then will guide you because she knows the pros and cons in all the processes. So you don't have to be in Ghana. Wherever you are in America, in Ro Russia, wherever you are watching the Budley's people, uh, you can write to her, she will get the land for you, pay your money to her, she will acquire the land, make sure you get all the documentation, and then I will prepare an estimate, uh, Jonathan will prepare the drawing, I'll prepare the estimate, and together you can get your dream house. So you can see the whole process. It's neatly, you know, orchestrated, so you don't have to do so much. All you have to do is make payment make payment make payment make payment get receipts get receipts get receipts that's all you have to do so just keep working make the money contact uh, madam lisa and london for your land she will guide you and take you to jonathan jonathan will get you the drawing and then will come to me i'll prepare the estimate and i will mobilize my team to go to the site and they will put up the house for you once your house is going on, Madam Lisa in London can give you video footages. They can make a drone footage and show you whatever that is happening. You understand? Myself, I make videos, but I don't have the time to do the drone because there's nobody there to do the drone. So all these were shot by Mr. London and they shared that with me. Isn't that beautiful? Yes. Look at the entire area. It's greenery. It's peaceful. And so having your neighbors, 
you know having the same like-minded people it puts you at ease you understand an area devoid of burglars devoid of bad people you know very nice community people are like-minded they think the same you can put up um, a family yard maybe uh, uh, that you can talk to the land people they will create an area where it's going to be like a park where people can come with their kids and play around it's so beautiful it's so beautiful so madam lisa has two plots this is the back plot and she's going to use it as a backyard <laughs> yeah she's going to have her planters flowers growing her own natural organic food you understand all these are well thought well orchestrated are you with me and so you can achieve the same provided you align yourself with the right people it is always my message find the right people because every decision we make there are consequences at the end of that decision but you to you you've made a decision the probability that it will turn out good or bad is based on your judgment and so align yourself with the right people don't be deceived by people doing a whole lot of thumbnails pictures and all of that to deceive you be very wise be very objective you understand i want you to be very skeptical in that way be very skeptical ask questions that perhaps might even provoke the person and know the, the temperament of the person you understand real people cannot stand truth organic people cannot stand truth because when the truth is posed to them they get offended but that is the truth are you with me yes yeah, so talk to them be very skeptical and make a decision align yourself with the right people and you will see the success like i said success and failure are synonymous and so you be the decider of your success are you with me madam lisa followed me for continuously one year and due to my consistency i have been very constant are you with me yes she decided to reach out to me are you with me and i responded as as i can i respond to everybody the same sometimes people send me emails and even months goes by they've not even heard from me i am very skeptical same because a lot of people try to scam me so i'm very careful that's mr london <laughs> very calm nice gentleman very calm you know very peaceful he's not troublesome you know yeah, if you have kind of a husband of that type man you don't have a problem <laughs> so mr landon that is a tip for you okay so this is a kind of a small tent we created for for the people to sit down and relax okay yeah just sit down and relax here everything is bought here that's madame lisa and my sister sitting down there you understand so plumbing work is taking place we've bought pressure pipes original interplast are you with me yes so the pipes will be positioned according to the client preference so you don't have to come back and start digging here and digging there it wouldn't be appropriate are you with me it wouldn't be appropriate so making sure that everything conforms to the drawing and whatever be the correction we have to do at the same time the still fixes are other side they are doing what we call the footings beam or the ground beams you understand they are doing the footings beams or the ground beams so at the same time the masons are also doing the fencing they are laying the blocks and ensuring everything goes on well so it's a speed work and myself i don't like to delay project we have to move in a space of time are you with me we have to be very smooth and my sister is very consistent she makes sure materials are at the site constantly. Constantly materials are available. We don't want to run short of materials. And then they say the vehicle cannot come. They are stuck on the road. And that, and that, and that, and that. No. Constantly my sister is making sure material, And that is why I place her there. Because I don't want to have any issue with my client. The right type of materials have been purchased. Everything in the right proportion. Are you with me? No shortcut anyway no shortcut anyway this is beautiful this is beautiful look at them sitting quietly so beautiful are you with me and all this place is going to be the backyard for madame lisa and london this is their backyard so in case you have such a backyard you can do a lot of vegetation 
do whatever you want kids can come and play around you can have a swimming pool in the future because i mean that's another cost though the cost of maintaining a swimming pool a lot of people don't understand you just get up and put up a swimming pool but it is up to your preference you know if you want to put up a swimming pool you should be ready with the cost that comes with it maintaining is another problem are you with me you should get because people that want to get swimming pool in their houses they know the standard they know the quality of what they want but some people just see it and then oh i want a swimming pool without even them being around to even use it they put up the swimming pool they don't even know how to swim <laughs> they don't even know how to swim and so it's just like i just want to have it because i saw it in a, at someone's house and i want to have the same thing no a house that we are putting up for one of my subscribers um she's a doctor and the husband is a swimmer so having a swimming pool in the house they know the benefit of having the swimming pool for exercise the husband will have to swim every day or every other day you understand there's a swimmer in the house they want to swim and train the kids all the kids are swimmers they will swim and make use of the swimming pool are you with me some people have swimming pool and years gone by nobody has even jumped in there and they've spent lots of money putting up the swimming pool but it's of no benefit are you with me so this is the iron rod you see the rebar those are what we call the footings beams or ground beams are you with me it is done in a in a rectangle form not a triangle form very strong and solid the pipes have in position in advantage locations are you with me as per the client preference it is covered with the end caps okay those are end cap those white things you see are called end caps it is very, very important because most plumbers finish work and they don't close them and you have unwanted particles jumping in there so by the time you're ready to use your wc or your wash basin it is already clogged up you understand everything should be sealed this one because there's no end cap see what they do they, they've cut it and they use um, heat to fold it up you understand it is very very important it is very very important and the pipes should be pressure pipe quality pipes are you with me yes the blocks you're using should be of quality blocks okay it should be of quality blocks six inches quarry dust are you with me cement 42.5 r because most of these factories have also tend kind of reducing the quality of the cement especially when it comes to iron rods before when you get a 12 mm iron rod it is so thick but now when you buy a 12 mm iron rod it looks funny they are reducing it so in areas where you can use 12 mm now you can't use 12 mm anymore you have to use 14 mm in areas where you have to use 14 mm now you can use 14 mm anymore but instead you have to upgrade and go for 16 mm in areas where you have to use 16 mm now you have to use 18 or even 20 you understand so it makes work somehow a bit challenging because prices would have to change based on the current occurrences at the site based on the site condition we have to modify the estimate you understand and that is is a very bad thing so this time around when i'm preparing estimate i pay key attention to measurement the span from a to b what is the span when i look at the span and 14 mm can fit in there i recommend 14 mm if it's necessary we use 16 mm we revise the estimate even before the client approves the estimate we have revised and we know what type of iron rod is supposed to go here and there and there and there you understand so that it doesn't create that kind of inconsistency every time you have to go back to the client i need a i need b it's not professional are you with me it is not professional so uh, lovely people my name is mr bright antonio if you need my services you can always reach out to me my email is on the screen you can write to me if in case you want to get in touch with me you can get through me through my artisans their numbers are on the screen myself i don't like displaying my number because sometimes people will just be bugging me all the time so i know people who really need me they write to me some people don't know how to send email no problem just pick the number on the screen my foreman christopher today and he will give you my number so you can talk to me 
You understand? It shows that you really need my services. And so you will do everything just to get to me. Are you with me? Yes, yeah, it is very, very important. So lovely people, this brings us to the end of the video where I'll come your way with episode 9 with the Oversight Casting. Okay? Subscribe and make us number one. From me to you, Shalom. God bless you wherever you are. Bye-bye.